a pesar de que. In spite of the fact that. In spite of the fact that. El inglés se convirtió en el idioma oficial de los negocios, en el siglo XXI en muchos países, a pesar de que no se considera un idioma fácil. English became the official language of business by the 21st century in many countries, in spite of the fact that it isn't considered to be an easy language. English became the official language of business by the 21st century in many countries, in spite of the fact that it isn't considered to be an easy language. A medida que. As. As. Te vuelves más sabio a medida que obtienes más experiencia y comprensión sobre la vida. You become wiser as you gain more experience and understanding about life. You become wiser as you gain more experience and understanding about life. Debido a. Due to. Due to. Debido a la gran cantidad de personas obesas, los programas de pérdida de peso se han convertido en el tema de muchos libros y artículos de revistas. Due to the large number of obese people, weight loss programs have become the topics of many books and magazine articles. Due to the large number of obese people, weight loss programs have become the topics of many books and magazine articles. Debido a que. Due to the fact that. Due to the fact that. El índice de graduados desempleados es relativamente alto, debido a que las aspiraciones de los graduados no coinciden con las oportunidades de empleo existentes. The rate of unemployed graduates is relatively high due to the fact that the aspirations of graduates do not match existing employment opportunities. The rate of unemployed graduates is relatively high due to the fact that the aspirations of graduates do not match existing employment opportunities. Al. Bye. Bye. Los expertos en salud mental afirman que la vida de sus pacientes mejora dramáticamente simplemente al dejar atrás sus hábitos poco saludables. Mental health experts claim that their patients' lives dramatically improve simply by leaving their unhealthy habits behind. Mental health experts claim that their patients' lives dramatically improve simply by leaving their unhealthy habits behind. A menos que. Unless. Unless. A menos que se exploren todas las alternativas, nunca podremos estar seguros de haber tomado la decisión correcta. Unless all the alternatives are explored, we can never be sure if we have made the right decision. Unless all the alternatives are explored, we can never be sure if we have made the right decision. Como si. As if. As if. Jugar juegos de realidad virtual y aumentada te hace sentir como si fueras parte de otro espacio y tiempo. Playing virtual and augmented reality games makes you feel as if you were being a part of another space and time. Playing virtual and augmented reality games makes you feel as if you were being a part of another space and time. Aún así. Yet. 
yet. El gobierno ha reducido el número de conciertos al aire libre para los próximos meses. Y aún así, todos están esperando que se anuncien los próximos eventos musicales. The government has reduced the number of open air concerts for the next few months. And yet, everybody is waiting for the upcoming music events to be announced. The government has reduced the number of open air concerts for the next few months. And yet, everybody is waiting for the upcoming music events to be announced. Sin embargo, however, however, el área ha sido cerrada a los automóviles, sin embargo, está permitido el tráfico de vehículos de transporte público y bicicletas. The area has been closed off for cars. However, traffic for vehicles of public transportation and bicycles is permitted. The area has been closed off for cars. However, traffic for vehicles of public transportation and bicycles is permitted. Sin embargo, no obstante. Nevertheless. Nevertheless, es difícil pedir su ayuda ya que siempre está tan preocupado con sus tareas diarias. No obstante, deberíamos intentarlo. It's difficult to ask for his help since he is always so preoccupied with his daily tasks. Nevertheless, we should give it a try. It's difficult to ask for his help since he is always so preoccupied with his daily tasks. Nevertheless, we should give it a try. Mientras que. Whereas. Whereas. Sandra siempre trabaja despacio pero con precisión. Mientras que yo suelo apresurarme a las cosas y con frecuencia cometo errores. Sandra always works slowly but precisely, whereas I tend to rush things and frequently make mistakes. Sandra always works slowly but precisely, whereas I tend to rush things and frequently make mistakes. ¿Para qué? So that. So that. Dejé algo de tiempo libre en mi agenda para la próxima semana, para que podamos discutir cómo ha estado manejando sus nuevas responsabilidades. I freed up some time in my schedule for next week, so that we can discuss how you have been handling your new responsibilities. I freed up some time in my schedule for next week, so that we can discuss how you have been handling your new responsibilities. Para. In order to. In order to. Necesitamos más datos para tomar una decisión racional sobre los próximos proyectos de construcción de escuelas. We need more data in order to make a rational decision on the upcoming school building projects. We need more data in order to make a rational decision on the upcoming school building projects. En lugar, más bien. Instead. Instead. Si no puedes especificar tus objetivos exactos para los próximos días, más bien haz un resumen mensual más general de los planes. If you cannot specify your exact goals for the next few days, make a more general monthly summary of plans instead. If you cannot specify your exact goals for the next few days, make a more general monthly summary of plans instead.
de tal manera que in such a way that in such a way that Dado que mi conferencia sobre inversión personal es para ciudadanos promedio, debo presentarla de tal manera que incluso las personas sin conocimientos en finanzas puedan entenderla. Since my lecture on personal investment is for average citizens, I must present it in such a way that even people with no knowledge in finance can understand it. Since my lecture on personal investment is for average citizens, I must present it in such a way that even people with no knowledge in finance can understand it. Tan que such that such that Las sociedades que envejecen presentan problemas tan complejos que son imposibles de resolver a corto plazo. Aging societies present such complex issues that they are impossible to solve in a short term. Aging societies present such complex issues that they are impossible to solve in a short term. No solo, sino que también. Not only, but also. Not only, but also. No solo los cereales integrales son nutritivos, sino que también están llenos de fibra. Not only are whole grains nutritious, but they are also packed with fiber. Not only are whole grains nutritious, but they are also packed with fiber. Aunque. While. While. Aunque los suplementos vitamínicos no pueden reemplazar por completo una dieta saludable, tomarlos es una buena opción si no hay alimentos ricos en vitaminas disponibles. While vitamin supplements can't entirely replace a healthy diet, taking them is a good option if foods rich in vitamins are unavailable. While vitamin supplements can't entirely replace a healthy diet, taking them is a good option if foods rich in vitamins are unavailable. Es probable que. It is likely that. It is likely that. Es probable que sin metas específicas y detalladas, los sueños solo seguirán siendo sueños. It is likely that without specific and detailed goals, dreams will only remain dreams. It is likely that without specific and detailed goals, dreams will only remain dreams. Es poco probable que. It is unlikely that. It is unlikely that. Es poco probable que su experiencia y trabajo duro pasen desapercibidos para sus superiores. It is unlikely that his expertise and hard work will go unnoticed by his superiors. It is unlikely that his expertise and hard work will go unnoticed by his superiors. En caso de Should Should En caso de necesitar más información, por favor contácteme. Should you require any further information, please contact me. Should you require any further information, please contact me. Sí. If. If. El examinador me preguntó si estaba nervioso o no, pero le dije que no. 
The examiner asked me if I was nervous or not, but I told him I wasn't. The examiner asked me if I was nervous or not, but I told him I wasn't. Si. Weather. Weather. No estamos hablando de si es o no un puesto competitivo. Por supuesto que lo es. We're not talking about whether or not it's a competitive position. Of course, it is. We're not talking about whether or not it's a competitive position. Of course, it is. Estar a punto de. Be about to. Be about to. Estoy a punto de llamar al señor Jones. ¿Quieres que le cuente sobre el nuevo cliente? I'm about to call Mr. Jones. Would you like me to tell him about the new client? I'm about to call Mr. Jones. Would you like me to tell him about the new client? Incluso si, aunque. Even if. Even if. Defiende lo que es realmente importante para ti, aunque a veces eso signifique estar solo, sin el apoyo de nadie. Stand up for what is really important to you, even if it means standing alone sometimes, without support from anyone. Stand up for what is really important to you, even if it means standing alone sometimes, without support from anyone. Incluso cuando. Even when. Even when. Es muy recomendable incorporar el ejercicio físico en tu rutina semanal, incluso cuando parezca que estás trabajando sin parar. It is highly recommended to incorporate physical exercise into your weekly routine, even when you seem to be working non-stop. It is highly recommended to incorporate physical exercise into your weekly routine, even when you seem to be working non-stop. Incluso después. Even after. Even after. Mi novio fue internado en el hospital incluso después de que su análisis de sangre resultó negativo. My boyfriend was kept in hospital even after his blood test came back negative. My boyfriend was kept in hospital even after his blood test came back negative. Incluso antes. Even before. Even before. De alguna manera supe que había pasado a la siguiente ronda de entrevistas incluso antes de contestar el teléfono. Somehow I knew I made it to the next round of interviews even before I answered the phone. Somehow I knew I made it to the next round of interviews even before I answered the phone. Sin importar. Whatever. Whatever. Sin importar las objeciones que tengas respecto al cambio tecnológico, probablemente no sean compartidas por la mayoría de las personas de las generaciones más jóvenes. Whatever objections you have to technological change, they are probably not shared by most people of younger generations. Whatever objections you have to technological change, they are probably not shared by most people of younger generations.
En cuanto. Whenever. Whenever. En cuanto estés lista para casarte, estaré encantada de diseñar tu vestido de novia. Whenever you're ready to get married, I'll be happy to design your wedding gown. Whenever you're ready to get married, I'll be happy to design your wedding gown. ¿Quién? Whoever. Whoever. Quien quiera ser voluntario en nuestro campamento de guardería, debe registrarse en línea al final de la semana. Whoever wants to be a volunteer in our daycare camp, they should register online by the end of the week. Whoever wants to be a volunteer in our daycare camp, they should register online by the end of the week. Donde quiera que. Wherever. Wherever. Donde quiera que vivas, mientras tengas internet, puedes encargarte de prácticamente todo desde la comodidad de tu hogar. Wherever you live, as long as you have internet, you can take care of practically everything from the comfort of your home. Wherever you live, as long as you have internet, you can take care of practically everything from the comfort of your home. Cualquiera que sea. Whichever. Whichever. Cualquiera que sea el país al que quieras mudarte, deberás adaptarse a su cultura. Whichever country you intend to move to, you'll need to adjust to its culture. Whichever country you intend to move to, you'll need to adjust to its culture. Si no fuera por. If it wasn't for. If it wasn't for. Si no fuera por la barrera del idioma, consideraría mudarme incluso a Corea. If it wasn't for the language barrier, I would consider moving even to Korea. If it wasn't for the language barrier, I would consider moving even to Korea. Si no hubiera sido por. If it hadn't been for. If it hadn't been for. Si no hubiera sido por Chris, no podríamos haber tomado este préstamo tan rápido. If it hadn't been for Chris, we couldn't have taken this loan so fast. If it hadn't been for Chris, we couldn't have taken this loan so fast. De casualidad. Happened to. Happened to. Si de casualidad tienes tiempo libre el viernes, podríamos encontrarnos para tomar un café. If you happen to have some spare time on Friday, we could meet for a coffee. If you happen to have some spare time on Friday, we could meet for a coffee. Debería haber hecho. Should have done. Should have done. Tienes toda la razón. Debería haber mencionado mi ascenso antes. You're absolutely right. I should have mentioned my promotion to you earlier. You're absolutely right. I should have mentioned my promotion to you earlier. Podría haber hecho. 
Might have done. Might have done. Len ya podría haber respondido mi correo electrónico. No me acuerdo. Lane might have answered my email already. I can't remember. Lane might have answered my email already. I can't remember. Puede que haya hecho. May have done. May have done. No lo sé con certeza, pero el gobernador puede que haya aprobado la nueva propuesta del Comité de Construcción. I don't know for certain, but the governor may have approved the building committee's new proposal. I don't know for certain, but the governor may have approved the building committee's new proposal. No necesita haber hecho. Needn't have done. Needn't have done. Dado que hay mucho que explorar en nuestro propio país, nuestros estudiantes no necesitan haber salido al extranjero en un viaje de estudios. Since there is a lot to explore in our own country, our students needn't have gone abroad on a class trip. Since there is a lot to explore in our own country, our students needn't have gone abroad on a class trip. Debe haber hecho. Must have done. Must have done. Caroline debe haber heredado una gran cantidad de dinero de su abuelo. Probablemente por eso está remodelando su casa. Caroline must have inherited a great deal of money from her grandpa. Probably that's why she is refurbishing her house. Caroline must have inherited a great deal of money from her grandpa. Probably that's why she is refurbishing her house. Podría haber hecho. Could have done. Could have done. Podrían haber elegido unas vacaciones en la playa en Italia pero en cambio viajaron a Islandia. They could have chosen a beach holiday in Italy, but they traveled to Iceland instead. They could have chosen a beach holiday in Italy, but they traveled to Iceland instead. No poder haber hecho. Can have done. Can have done. Jake no puede haber llegado tan temprano. Acaba de salir de Toronto. Jake can't have arrived so early. He's just left Toronto. Jake can't have arrived so early. He's just left Toronto. Habría hecho. Would have done. Would have done. Yo le habría asignado el trabajo si hubiera mostrado el más mínimo interés en él. I would have assigned him the job if he had shown the slightest interest in it. I would have assigned him the job if he had shown the slightest interest in it. Se espera que. Be expected to. Be expected to. Nuestro paquete se espera que llegue el 12 de diciembre. Our package is expected to arrive on December 12. Our package is expected to arrive on December 12. Se dijo. Be said to. 
be said to. Se dice que una gran cantidad de especies de animales salvajes están al borde de la extinción debido a la destrucción de los bosques. A huge number of wild animal species is said to be on the verge of extinction because of the destruction of forests. A huge number of wild animal species is said to be on the verge of extinction because of the destruction of forests. No se supone que. Be not supposed to. Be not supposed to. Se supone que los niños no deberían abrir sus regalos hasta el día de Navidad. Kids are not supposed to open their presents until Christmas Day. Kids are not supposed to open their presents until Christmas Day. Se supone que. Be supposed to. Be supposed to. Se supone que el levantamiento de pesas es muy beneficioso para nuestra resistencia. Weightlifting is supposed to be highly beneficial for our stamina. Weightlifting is supposed to be highly beneficial for our stamina. Parece que. Appear to. Appear to. Según la policía, este caso parece que requiere más investigación. According to the police, this case appears to require further investigation. According to the police, this case appears to require further investigation. Demostrar ser. Prove to. Prove to. Finalmente, nuestro nuevo colega demostró ser un líder de grupo de contabilidad muy talentoso. Eventually, our new colleague proved to be a very gifted accounting group leader. Eventually, our new colleague proved to be a very gifted accounting group leader. Parece. Seem to. Seem to. Michael siempre parece reaccionar a mis propuestas de manera positiva. Michael always seems to react to my proposals positively. Michael always seems to react to my proposals positively. Parece que estar haciendo. Seem to be doing. Seem to be doing. Parece que estamos gastando mucho más de lo que nuestro presupuesto nos permite. We seem to be spending way more than our budget would allow. We seem to be spending way more than our budget would allow. Debería haber estado haciendo. Should have been doing. Should have been doing. Debería haber estado cocinando por la tarde, en lugar de perder el tiempo leyendo las columnas de chismes de las revistas. I should have been cooking in the afternoon instead of wasting my time with reading the gossip columns of magazines. I should have been cooking in the afternoon instead of wasting my time with reading the gossip columns of magazines. Puede haber estado haciendo. May have been doing. May have been doing. Lo 
Los chicos de mi clase pueden haber estado esperándome, pero yo no lo sabía. The boys from my class may have been waiting for me, but I didn't know. The boys from my class may have been waiting for me, but I didn't know. Podría haber estado haciendo. Might have been doing. Might have been doing. Ellos podrían haber estado persiguiendo al tipo equivocado todo este tiempo. They might have been chasing the wrong guy all along. They might have been chasing the wrong guy all along. No es necesario haber estado haciendo. Needn't have been doing. Needn't have been doing. Los actores no habían recibido ninguna instrucción, por lo que no necesitaban haber estado ensayando la nueva obra durante toda la tarde. The actors hadn't received any instructions, so they needn't have been rehearsing the new play all afternoon. The actors hadn't received any instructions, so they needn't have been rehearsing the new play all afternoon. Debe estar haciendo. Must have been doing. Must have been doing. El gobierno local debe haber estado trabajando en el nuevo programa de apoyo financiero, porque su portavoz acaba de anunciar que está lista para la conferencia de prensa. The local government must have been working on the new financial support package because its spokesperson has just announced that she is ready for the press conference about it. The local government must have been working on the new financial support package because its spokesperson has just announced that she is ready for the press conference about it. No podría haber estado haciendo. Couldn't have been doing. Couldn't have been doing. No podría haber estado nadando a las cinco, porque estaba en casa de mi madre, ayudándola a quitar la maleza del jardín. I couldn't have been swimming at five, because I was at my mother's house helping her weed the garden then. I couldn't have been swimming at five, because I was at my mother's house helping her weed the garden then. Debería estar haciendo. Should be doing. Should be doing. Deberíamos estar trabajando en la elaboración de las nuevas normas de seguridad, en lugar de discutir lo que almorzamos. We should be working on drawing up the new safety regulations instead of discussing what we have for lunch. We should be working on drawing up the new safety regulations instead of discussing what we have for lunch. Podría estar haciendo. Might be doing. Might be doing. No estoy seguro de dónde está Joy pero podría estar mirando su programa de televisión favorito en su habitación. I'm not sure where Joe is, but he might be watching his favorite TV show in his room. I'm not sure where Joe is, but he might be watching his favorite TV show in his room. No puede estar haciendo. Can't be doing. Can't be doing. Seila no puede estar dando una entrevista. Se estoy hablando por teléfono con ella ahora mismo. Sheila can't be giving an interview. I'm on the phone with her right now. Sheila can't be giving an interview. I'm on the phone with her right now.
Debe estar haciendo. Must be doing. Must be doing. No encuentro a los perros en la casa, así que deben estar jugando afuera. I can't find the dogs in the house, so they must be playing outside. I can't find the dogs in the house, so they must be playing outside. No estaría haciendo. Wouldn't be doing. Wouldn't be doing. No te estaría diciendo estas cosas si no fueran importantes. I wouldn't be telling you these things if they weren't important. I wouldn't be telling you these things if they weren't important. Haría. Would. Would. Cuando todavía vivía con mis padres, iríamos de viaje a las colinas todos los fines de semana. When I was still living with my parents, we would go on a trip to the hills every weekend. When I was still living with my parents, we would go on a trip to the hills every weekend. Mientras. As long as. As long as. Mientras permanezcas perseverante en lo que estás haciendo, estarás en el camino hacia el éxito. As long as you remain consistent in what you're doing, you are on the road to success. As long as you remain consistent in what you're doing, you are on the road to success. Cuando se aplica correctamente. When applied correctly. When applied correctly. Cuando se aplican correctamente, estas gotas reducen la resequedad de los ojos causada por los monitores. When applied correctly, these drops reduce dryness of the eyes caused by monitors. When applied correctly, these drops reduce dryness of the eyes caused by monitors. Abriendo la puerta. Opening the door. Opening the door. Abriendo la puerta, me tropecé accidentalmente con un gato. Opening the door, I accidentally tripped over a cat. Opening the door, I accidentally tripped over a cat. Está hecho. Is done. Is done. Más y más estacionamientos subterráneos están establecidos por la ciudad. More and more underground parking lots are established by the city. More and more underground parking lots are established by the city. Fue hecho. Was done. Was done. Las propuestas para aumentar el número de semáforos en la ciudad fueron discutidas en la reunión del Consejo de Transporte de la semana pasada. Proposals to increase the number of traffic lights in the city were discussed at last week's Transportation Council meeting. Proposals to increase the number of traffic lights in the city were discussed at last week's Transportation Council meeting. Había sido hecho. Had been done. Had been done. Estaba hecho. 
el gobernador señaló que estos viejos puentes del centro de la ciudad habían sido descuidados durante años y necesitan una renovación completa. The governor pointed out that these old inner city bridges had been neglected for years and need a thorough renovation. The governor pointed out that these old inner city bridges had been neglected for years and need a thorough renovation. Se está haciendo. Is being done. Is being done. Las calles del centro de Río de Janeiro ya están siendo cerradas en estos momentos. The downtown streets of Rio de Janeiro are already being closed down as we speak. The downtown streets of Rio de Janeiro are already being closed down as we speak. Estaba siendo. Was being done. Was being done. Por esta época el año pasado, nuestra sala de estar estaba siendo reformada. This time last year our living room was being redecorated. This time last year our living room was being redecorated. Se habría hecho. Would have been done. Would have been done. Si el lugar no hubiera quedado en la quiebra, nuestra boda se habría realizado aquí. If it hadn't gone bankrupt, our wedding would have been held in this place. If it hadn't gone bankrupt, our wedding would have been held in this place. Podría haber sido hecho. Could have been done. Could have been done. El accidente podría haber sido evitado si hubiéramos tenido más cuidado. The accident could have been avoided if we had been more careful. The accident could have been avoided if we had been more careful. Puede haber sido hecho. May have been done. May have been done. El corte de energía puede haber sido causado por condiciones climáticas extremas. The power cut may have been caused by extreme weather conditions. The power cut may have been caused by extreme weather conditions. Debería haber sido hecho. Should have been done. Should have been done. El argumento debería haber sido manejado de una manera más positiva. The argument should have been handled in a more positive manner. The argument should have been handled in a more positive manner. Se debe haber hecho. Must have been done. Must have been done. El periodo de exámenes de Henry se debe haber terminado, ya no parece tan estresado. Henry's exam period must have been finished. He doesn't seem so stressed anymore. Henry's exam period must have been finished. He doesn't seem so stressed anymore. Me ofrecieron. I was offered. I was offered. Me ofrecieron el puesto de director de proyecto, sin embargo, todavía dudo en aceptarlo. 
I was offered the position of project manager, however, I'm still hesitant about accepting it. I was offered the position of project manager, however, I'm still hesitant about accepting it. A las mujeres les gusta que les recuerden. Women like being reminded. Women like being reminded. A todas las mujeres les gusta que les recuerden lo hermosas que son. All women like being reminded of how beautiful they are. All women like being reminded of how beautiful they are. Ojalá hicieras algo. I wish you did something. I wish you did something. Ojalá tuvieras más tiempo para pasar con nosotros. I wish you had more time to spend with us. I wish you had more time to spend with us. Ojalá hubieras hecho algo. I wish you had done something. I wish you had done something. Ojalá hubiera descubierto este fabuloso café antes. I wish I had discovered this fabulous little café earlier. I wish I had discovered this fabulous little café earlier.